Hi, I'm Steve Vyslava, and I'm the president of Care2 Innovations, and I've been a firefighter paramedic for over 30 years. I invented the SIP Quick Cervical Splint. It is a vacuum splint, like other vacuum splints we've used in the field, but it's for your neck. Now I'm going to show you a few quick pointers on how to apply the SIP Quick properly. The natural tendency for a patient when you go to apply a collar is for them to lift their head up. We don't want them to do that. We want them to stay in place and not move. It's a sip quick, a fast, stabilize in place splint. Wrap it comfortably, not snug where you're choking the neck, just a wrap around the chin even, just like that, and mold it down to the patient comfortably. And then gently hold up here, not down where you're strangling the neck up here by the cheeks just as a little bit more stability while you're vacuuming out. Now it's a custom fit. It is comfortable and I am stabilized in place and I'm ready for transport. Now we're going to show you a few other ways to apply the SIP quick. We are now going to demonstrate the one rescuer technique. The most important thing in this technique is to uh, advise a patient not to move their head. Sir, I'm going to be placing a product around your neck. I need you to keep your head in a stable position throughout this process. So the rescuer is going to snugly apply the sip quick collar around the neck. I'm going to secure with one hand the cheek and jaw and then rapidly pump for approximately five to seven seconds. The patient is now comfortably stabilized in place. To apply the sip quick in a patient in a supine position, what you'll want to do is flip the sip quick over, align the left edge of the product with the right side of the patient's head, gently strip slide under the neck, folding the product over and securing with a Velcro. Once secure, again secure the cheek and chin gently and rapidly pump for five to seven seconds. Once again, your patient is stabilized comfortably in place.